I mean, that, that it, this is just a continuation of a lifestyle that I've lived. Fantastic. That's great to hear, man. I, I, I assume that it makes a big difference because uh, seeing you at 60, that's, that's my goal, man. I want to be exactly where you're at at 60 physically. No oh, doubt. thank you. Yeah, yeah. Um, so diet, what, what, what is the diet secret for, uh, for the home arms? Are there any correlation with your hormone regulation and the food you're eating? Yes. So uh, you need a well-balanced diet. Now, by well-balanced, this is my definition. Diet is a very controversial issue because it's, it's much more complicated than people will understand. And I don't believe that there's one diet that's perfect for everybody. I agree. But in general, you want uh, a diet that's mostly plant-based, lots of leafy green vegetables, lots of colors, but you need meat. Uh, you know, I... I yeah, yeah, yeah. I, was, I was just going to say, what's your, your protein uh, percentage? I, I don't know the percentage, but I would say it's like 10%, 10%. Okay. of my diet. How long and, have you been doing it in that manner? Uh, about a year and a half. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and that has helped. The, the, you need the protein and fat. You need fat in your diet for hormones. Hormones are basically a fat-based molecule. And uh, so if you're not getting adequate fat, and that's the problem with like the vegan diet, you're, they're not getting adequate levels of fat. But you don't want to go all the way to the other end of the spectrum, of where, you know, like the carnivore diet. Then you're not getting the vegetables you need, and that's important for. Yeah, there's minerals vegetables. and other. Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff in potatoes that people don't even know. You know, a baked potato yeah. goes a long way, and salad goes a long way, and a couple of issues can be resolved in just a few things. Yeah, it's it's a wild thing because you know you hear stories, you know, of uh, guys that uh, make the world record where they're the oldest man alive, and they run to these guys while they're still alive, and what's the secret to your life? And they always ask, you know, as many questions as they can. And one of the big ones they ask is, what do you eat? And I remember there was one guy in New York City when he was like 112 or whatever it was, still walking. 